this film, near 200 hours of material. Uh, one of the big challenges was to have just an hour and 15 minutes of this material. <laughs> and it's a co-production with Brazil. That's why you see some Brazilian credits in the credit list. Um, and in Peru, where we have uh, just a few fiction films, feature length per year, and maybe just one feature documentary uh, every couple years. So we are very happy to have at Hot Dogs two films made in Peru. <laughs> and personally to have been involved also in the second one as an executive producer and also it's a film of Guarango, it's a non-profit association that since 15 years ago we work in making this type of documentary, of social documentaries. So um, if you want to uh, I'm just going to ask the first question. Yeah. Uh, uh, so tell us, so tell us about the idea of it, like, and uh, the research that went into it, and, and and basically how you scoured and found the characters that you did. Give us some. Well, the, in the beginning, we were looking for because we we have been working in several projects exploring conflicts in Peru. So we did two films about uh, communities defending their rights land, their environment, uh, fighting, facing transnational companies. So we wanted to, to, to explore a point of encounter in the Peruvian society. So I think the most interesting thinking about uh, Peru comes from the kitchen. Since uh, 10 years ago, uh, we are looking at the kitchen not just a place to be fed but to be proud of identity, of our identity as a multicultural uh, country. And well, this uh, movement of chef uh, guided by Gastón Acurio, um, they are doing a very incredible job in creating opportunities through gastronomy to the whole Peruvian society, not just the gourmet side of the story. So that's why we uh, ended up uh, making and researching this film. And the research, actually, uh, I was uh, filming outside Peru, for instance, because I was invited to some film festival in Europe, and so as now we could film with a digital camera I, that I had in my knapsack. I, uh, it takes just to a couple of questions to Peruvians uh, that I've met and ask, what is the best Peruvian restaurant, no? And like, I'm here in Toronto, no? It, it will take me just five minutes to find out <laughs> where is the restaurant. We want that list. <laughs> yeah. 